Hi everyone, Ali here with a prompt pattern of error identification category called reflection pattern. Let's start. Large language models by definition are just that, models. They are learning algorithms trained on public information. They try to come up with the most plausible response depending on various factors. But say if the training data on the topic is garbage, it would give garbage as a response, resulting in incomplete, inaccurate, or ambiguous output. Training data is not always to blame. Reasons can include making assumptions and decisions out of a variety of possible options. Then there are cases where there is an output where you are kept wondering why or how it came to this conclusion. What was the rationale and what kind of assumptions were involved in generating that output? One really simple example can be if you ask it to suggest a hotel in a city you are visiting and you are given a sharp, crisp response, the Plaza Hotel. Wouldn't you be left scratching your head as to how and why it picked this one? out of dozens if not hundreds of options and whether it suits you or not. This is where a reflection pattern can help. The goal of this pattern is to make the model explain the rationale behind the answer it came up with. This helps you assess the answer's validity as well as provides you insight as to how the model came up with this particular response. This pattern helps clarifying assumptions, avoiding confusions, and revealing gaps in knowledge or understanding. It may also reveal what kind of data or inputs were involved in creating the response in question and what kind of processing the model performed to prioritize some options over the other. With the available output, you not only understand the inner details of how models generate the output, you are also able to address any shortcomings or issues with the default answer by incorporating this additional information to refine your prompt. You are also better able to gauge the accuracy of this response. This is an excellent tool if you are not getting expected output and know you need to refine your prompt, but not sure what changes would lead to expected results. The information generated with this pattern helps you debug your original prompt and helps you fix any shortcomings efficiently. Note, however, that this pattern is only helpful if you can meaningfully interpret the details it provides. All right, so the key contextual statements for this pattern are, whenever you generate an answer, explain the reasoning and assumptions behind your answer, and optionally, so I can improve my answer. This not only instructs the large language model to explain the reasoning and assumptions, it also tells the model that the intention is to improve the question. This helps model tune the answers to their specific purpose. The pattern can be used in a variety of examples. We already covered the hotel case where this can be efficiently used. Coming up with another, please suggest the three best authors for children's books age five to 10. When you provide an answer, please explain the reasoning and assumptions behind your response. If possible, use specific examples or evidence to support your answer as to why they are the best options. Moreover, please address any potential ambiguities or limitations in your answer to provide a more accurate response. That was it for the reflection pattern. Please give a thumbs up and share the video if it seems useful and subscribe to the channel to be notified of upcoming content. Thank you. Goodbye.